My name is Kelsey Holman and I've been doing watercolor for about five years now. I first started watercoloring when I met one of my best friends, Molly. She was really into watercoloring and so we started watercoloring at a coffee shop together just to kind of get to know each other and then she taught me a lot of good tips. The process of completing the watercolor from start to finish is pretty easy. You just have to gather all your supplies, so some watercolor paper, um, your paint brushes, your watercolor palette, any pencils or pens that you're going to use, and then um, I usually find a design or um, like a quote that I want to paint. Um, and then I'll like sketch it out with a pencil real quick and then I'll start watercoloring and then if I'm writing a quote or like a bible verse I'll write that over or like near the watercolor once it's dry in sharpie or pen. The technique that I use for watercoloring is just using a palette. You can use a palette or you could use um, like gels. Um, I prefer the palette, it's a lot simpler to use. You just fill up a cup of water, dip your brushes in it, and then get the little palette, um, whatever color you're going to be using, just get that little color wet and then um, do whatever stroke you need to on the paper. This summer I had hip surgery and was in the hospital for a couple days after and spent a lot of time recovering over the summer. So watercoloring was a great way to like keep my mind busy and give me something to do while I was just hanging out on the couch or in the hospital. It was a good way to stay connected with my friends and siblings, um, even if we couldn't get up and get out of the house. My favorite place to do watercolors is um, probably any coffee shop that's quiet, uh, has good vibes, but my most favorite is um, Fika. It's a coffee shop in my hometown in Colorado. Some of my favorite pieces I've created are just ones that are really simple. They might have like a little green wreath or like, plants or flowers watercolored and then usually like a quote or a verse that means a lot to me. I use calligraphy in my watercolor pieces to write a quote. Usually I'll do it after I watercolor and have let the watercolor dry and I'll write it over the flower or the leaf that I've watercolored and I use it just to add a little something unique to my watercolor pieces. I watercolor to relieve stress, to just like get to know other people and to interact with my friends. Um, it's a good outlet for my creativity and um, just a good way for me to relax and recenter myself. If I could describe watercolor in one word, um, it would be peaceful.